to not have her be able to speak is just, it's like, it's the opposite of what Nancy should be having to go through. We need to hear her voice. I miss her expressing herself. I miss that. There's a lot of loss with this disease. First he lost the ability to walk and use his legs, and now his voice is going. Although I haven't lost my ability to speak, I really recognize the importance of communication, even more so having so many friends with ALS having lost their ability to speak. The thing I would like people to know about ALS is how debilitating it is and how concerning it is to watch your loved one become weaker and lose function. You take for granted one speech and as Lorene's voice was slowly diminishing, you miss hearing a voice, not being able to hear somebody, you know, call out your name. Having ALS and not being able to speak is crazy. There's so much to say. It's a voice that will be able to communicate to these vocally, so appreciate what I have now before it's gone. I'm really excited about this campaign and I think it's so important for all of us who have voices to, to use them, to share that love and to bring awareness to ALS. Everybody needs to hear they're loved. I want to speak out for all of those people with ALS that don't have the ability to speak themselves. I challenge you to voice your love by making a video for friends and family members, letting them know how much they mean to you how important they are to you in your life. In honor of my husband, Stephen, who has ALS, I would like to voice my love for him. He's my love. My name is Miles. I have ALS, and it's very important to me that my family knows I love them. I will challenge all of you to Pull out your phone and express your love for each other. I love you, Nancy Lee Ryder. I would like to challenge you to pick up your phone and voice your love for somebody in your life in honor of those who have ALS and cannot. Tony, staying with me with through this is tremendous. After all these years with the amazing highs and deeper than deep lows, thanks for staying by me. You still make my heart throb and is amazing as ever. And I, Maureen, love you forever. I want to voice my love to my dear friend, Nancy Ryder, who has ALS. I love you, Nancy. And I challenge you to grab your phone and tell someone that you love them and post it. Let's make more money to raise awareness for ALS. Let's find a cure. I'm Justin Sung, the founder and CEO of Tron and BitTorrent. I'm proud to be working with the ALS Association this Valentine's Day to launch a campaign called Voice Your Love to honor those with ALS who no longer can speak. The Tron and BitTorrent community has over 100 million people, and it's possible that thousands of you have ALS. In your honor, I'm voicing my love and pledging a donation of 250,000 US dollars. One of the first Bitcoin contributors, Hal Finney, was diagnosed with ALS almost 10 years ago, around the same time that Bitcoin was founded. Bitcoin changed the world, and Hal was pivotal in that success but he lost his battle with the ALS before he was able to see the impact he made. It shows that the ALS can strike anyone at any time, no matter how successful. Today, I challenge my friends in the blockchain industry to make donation to the ALS Association. Together, we can help support ALS research and hopefully 
find a cure soon. Thank you.